Kennedy Plaza is Rhode Island's public transportation hub. From July 5th through August 12th, PhotoMem, AS220's youth photography program, worked to capture the stories of strangers we met at Kennedy Plaza in photographic portraits and audio interviews. Yeah, my name is Jermaine Adams, a.k.a. King Supreme with all goals getting accomplished. I'm just chilling, supposed to be meeting somebody for lunch right now. You know, things of that nature. You know, Swagger World, you know, Swagger World Salsa, Swagger World Jelly, you know, Swagger World's coming out all day. You know what I'm saying? The label Swagger World, you know, www.swaggaworld.com. What, um, what's one of the most craziest or most beautiful things you've seen down here in Kennedy Plaza? It's not that beautiful here to see unless the birds. This is the only thing beautiful I see here. The rest, I think it's ugly. The way they dress, the way they talk, the way they act. The only thing that I see clean in here nice is the bird. That's why if you come in here, you see me all alone. What the birds, right? The best thing I've seen at Kennedy Plaza. The free entertainment that they have, where they have groups come in and put on performances for people, but just spontaneous get-togethers between people where they sit down and jam. And You want to know who God is? He's one of the ripped-up bus drivers. Just keep riding them and you'll find them. When he's the man who says, you know, you don't have to rush to be anywhere today. Wherever you end up, it's the right place. That's when you'll know. How many people do you think use Kennedy Plaza on a daily basis? Like, 1,500? Yeah. 40 to 50,000. I'd say about 2,000. 10 to 15,000. I never really did a, a quick count, but... Rough estimate, I'd say 250, 300 people. Hundreds. I don't know, I haven't even been here like during the day, but I guess a few thousand at least. I'd say 10 to 12,000 a day. And these are my people. 